G'day mates, how's it going? My name's AGO, and welcome back to Kingdom Hearts Reverse Rebirth. So, at the end of the last episode, we took on the Parasite Cage uh, in Monstro, and with that, we were able to defeat him rather easily compared to Sora's campaign. And, of course, the whole thing with Organization 13 still going on. Um, don't know what to do about that, because Vexen was able to get data on Riku, and I'm thinking that's how he's going to create Replica. Riku. With that said though, I've done grinding, as usual, Sora, oh, not Sora, Riku's near level 25. Um, I've upgraded AP, DP, and HP, and as usual, it's time to move on. So, let's return to Castle Oblivion once again. And nothing, okay. Well, oh, that's just great. Well, <clears throat> Just move on to the next floor, see if we can trigger a cutscene there. What's happening to Sora? Namine's powers are being used to shuffle his memories as we speak. My Lucia may well succeed in getting his puppet. Sora would be a valuable asset to the organization. But my Lucia and Loxene's actions, they... leave me quite uneasy. And then there is Axel. Who knows what that one is thinking? Vexen should take care of this. His replica is soon to be completed. But Vexen despises Marluxia. Think of the mess it would make. So we must tell him. Isn't it better that Vexen clean up the mess than leave it to us? Right, so we know now that Vexen is working on the replica of Riku, and the other organization members that we that we are introduced to in Riku's story are aware of Malusha and Larkseen's plan to take over the organization. Sort of. They don't have a clear idea just yet. And they are, they are wary of Axel. So, let's see what happens. What is the next world? I think the next world is the last one we can go to, which is... Neverland. We are going to Neverland, which means we'd be fighting Captain Hook. This is definitely a world we've seen Riku in. We saw him in Final Mix come to this world to collect Kairi and take her back to Hollow Bastion. Of course, we didn't fight Riku here as Sora, as far as we know. Like, <clears throat> there could have been like a secret scene, but there wasn't in Final Mix, so I can't tell you. Key of Beginnings, yeah, get on with it. Now in Neverland. So, as usual, let me check out what my rooms, how many rooms I have to get through. Oh, there's a there's a fair few in this one. I like that. All right, let's go. Let's go up. Won't do any fighting until I get to the boss. So, what's a good card to grind on? Um. Lasting Days is pretty good, that actually helped out a lot. Especially if you are trying to grind fast. Every Heartless you hit will be stunned as soon as it's spawned in. I actually like this card as Riku. Uh, no. Uh, oh, and there we go. Oh, didn't quite make the cut there. Oops. Oh, damn it. Where's the ladder? Oh no, there's a platform bounce thingy. Alright, and up. Where's the damn door? There it is. Alright, up we go. Next is a two. Hmm. Let's see. Material Awakening, oh, well, Awakening, I like that. The cards are stronger. Actually, I need to check out Riku's deck. Find out what he's got for this world. Because <clears throat> I haven't checked it yet. And I'm losing my voice. Why? I have not done that much recording today. Review deck. View deck, okay. 7, 5, 3. Oh, he's got a couple zeros, which is good. But then there's all these other ones here. 
There's some high ones, but then there's a lot of low ones. Changes the values of all cards to zero. That could be useful. Slightly extends the range of attack cards. Always nullifies the enemy card. Oh, stops enemies from breaking card attacks. Attack cards you use. I like that. I might actually use that. Sacrifices reload speed to power up attack cards. Okay. We are getting somewhere. I better not have had to go the other way to get to this room, eh? Oop, 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 oop. Alright, let's find out. This one is a three. Uh, yep, we'll use Feeble Darkness. Oh, grinding is going to be long on this world. There's a lot more rooms to go through. My grinding is I go through every single room until they are empty. I do not make any excuses. I will fight everything. Uh, here we go. What's this? This would be a four. I do not have a four teaming darkness, but I will use a five. And I would like to use some teaming darkness here and there. Hey. Oh, crap. Okay. I want to point out something. I just got a second random joker. I love you, Riku. No, no, no. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Oh. Okay, so I've had these two fights now. I can already see this is going to be a problem. Alright, get rid of that because I don't use them. Yeah, I've got two of them. Unreal. That's awesome. Alright, here we go. It's time for the fight with Captain Hook. See how it goes. I don't think it's going to go too well. Honestly, that's just my opinion. Alright, you, you can do your dance. I can't let you win. Not here. Alright, um... Which one was it? It was Jafar Genie. Alright. Stop your shit. Alright, we got darkness. We're doing this. Oh, beautiful. Ah, oh, this is good. The Far Genie is actually really good. Dark Fubaga. Now let's use the Mickey inverse but in Oh He did not Whoa Um Yeah okay Just stop Just just stop Yes, good. Okay, that was that was a bit of a touch and go there near the end, but I was able to defeat Captain Hook. Thank you, Genie Jafar card. Never will I knock Genie Jafar again. Ever. No level up, of course not. Why would I? Hook. Still got the same stupid face. <laughs> oh dear. Well, that was rather fun, actually. I, I didn't mind the fight with Captain Hook there. Although the, um... Cards really, really sucked. Oh, no. Okay, I'm in a bit of a pickle, and I really, really need to get to a save point. And luckily, I have some of those, finally. I have a lot of those. I didn't realize I had that many. Alright, let's go. Let's go save, because that's it for this episode. <laughs> it's done. Holy crap. This is, without a doubt, going to be very fast. There's not going to be much footage shown of this particular part of Chain of Memories. Reverse Rebirth really doesn't have that much. Um, story to it. It does in between the worlds, but in the worlds themselves, that's it. It's just one boss fight, and you're done. 
for the most part. I think Holy Bastion so far has been the longest world yet, and that only took up one episode as well. That episode was only 25 minutes. This is going to be lucky to hit 10 minutes. This is a surprise. That said though, I will still grind, I will still complete this world 100%, and then I will move on. Hopefully I will reach level 31, because this trend of only getting 5 levels per floor is actually a little annoying. That said though, wait and see. So thank you all so much for watching this episode of Kingdom Hearts Reverse Rebirth, and if you did like it, make sure to leave a thumbs up, and go check out links in the description down below to the Kingdom Hearts Reverse Rebirth playlist. I just stuffed that up too, like last video. <clears throat> Check out links in the description down below to the Kingdom Hearts Final Mix playlist and the Kingdom Hearts Chain of Memories playlist, as well as all my social medias, and be sure to subscribe, like, and follow. And as always, I will see you guys in the next video. Goodbye. Again, this is the